what is going on everybody in this video I'm going to tell y'all exactly what's going on with this channel right now I'm very fucking pissed um around 1 12 31 o'clock I was trying to set up my live stream because I was about to make an important announcement because I want to stream it live um when I refresh my browser trying to see if I can set my own live stream come to turns to find out that I just received a community guideline strike and here's a screenshot of it um that video y'all see in that screenshot when I just told you the story about my MCN story when Payton Network dropped me and mine switching over to Freedom they claim they said it was flagged and claim it violated the community guidelines well I claim fully because <coughs> there was nothing wrong with it because I was telling my story about why Peyton never dropped me and the reason why I joined Freedom and so I went ahead and peeled that video so I went so I had to wait for the response so a couple hours like an hour 30 minutes to an hour later I just said Fuck it. I just delete the video instead so apparently with that command of guideline strike they will live stream on here for three months three months Community guideline strikes and the uh, copyright strikes are different. They have different. Um, you have those strikes. I'll, exp I'll explain the process. Apparently, once. All right. First, I'll go over it. Um. All right. I'm gonna start with the community guideline strikes, since I'm telling you all about the community guideline strike that had affected my live stream. The my ability to live stream on, on here because y'all love seeing me live stream on here because that's the only way I can gain subscribers. Well, once you can get a community guideline strike, when some, when one of your videos get flagged and YouTube reviews it and they decide it's violated the community guidelines or something, they will give you, they send you an email and give you a strike. Which means the first strike, you lose your ability to live stream, live stream on YouTube either using, well, if you go to your Creative Studio dashboard, uh, Creative Studio, you go to it says live streaming, it says live now, which means you gotta, it gives you your stream, um, uh, stream encoder and your stream key. You go to your streaming software like OBS Studio and others. Um, then it says events, which is Google Hangouts. Those two right there, either using your own, uh, either using OBS Studio or Google Hangouts. Those, with that community guideline strike, you will, you will able to use that. They will disable that feature until the three months, until that strike is cleared. So. So I gotta go back to it. Um, once you reach the second strike, if I can pull it up here again, right now the it's still in process. It says if you go to your features or go to open up a new tab and go to YouTube.com/features, since you'll be under your channel, and she's says your channel name, your profile picture, and should be verified. And should be, you should have underneath there. You should have a copyright status, which should be under good standing. And you community guide on the other side, side of it, and right side of it, it should be community guidelines. And it tells you what's the status of it. If it's in good standing, you see the play button with a happy face. If it's if you get a strike, 
you will see see it go down one. Then you see your all your features underneath them, you get, which you get uploading, monetization, live streaming, embed live streams, longer videos, unlisted and private videos, custom thumbnails, external and annotations, paid content, super chat, custom URL, content ID, sponsorships, the sponsorships and the zone for gaming channels as they currently at the it says at its time. But if you go where it says live streaming it will say under there it says your ability to live stream has been revoked which is disabled and your bed live streams it says ineligible and it says your account isn't 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 enabled for live streaming see so your live streaming feature says for more info then under community guidelines see in details and it tells you why the strike is there for and it says content and it says what type and event the strike and the content and the content I've been telling y'all is the, my MCN story and it tells you the reason violation of YouTube's community guidelines acknowledge on the date it was issued and expiration which is March 6, 2018 which I told y'all and right now it's being appealed now let me go there it tells you what happens the second time. All right, here you go. I'll put link to link to this uh, guideline strike in the description below. The second strike, if your account receives two community guideline strikes within three month period, you won't be able to post new content to YouTube for two weeks. If there are no further issues, full privileges will be restored automatically after two week period. Each strike will remain on your account and expire separately three months after it was issued. And now, here's the main one. This one's like, the third strike is like the copyright one. The third strike, if your account receives three community guideline strikes within a three month period, your account will be terminated completely, which means you lose all your subscribers, all your view accounts, um, all your videos that you've been currently posting that you've worked hard on, but you can, and will, you will lose your AdSense account as well, and if you made more channels on that account, uh, you probably lose them as well, but if But, but there's ways to, to appeal them, but there's ways to avoid it, those strikes. So I'll link this to it in the description, but I'm not showing on this video because but I just ran off on my computer screen. And now for the copyright, the copyright um, status. If you get one copyright strike, which is what it's copyrighted like a cartoon whether it's either by Fox DreamWorks or any um, popular um, company they will flag it for a copyright infringement and YouTube will get you for that they'll issue you a strike you, you won't be able to appeal it because it's copyrighted by somebody else and it's issued by a big company a multi-million dollar company and that strike each strike will expire in six months for each strike for two strikes for two copyright strikes is six months which means that you get two of them they won't expire for 12 um, the first strike will expire the first six months the second one won't expire for the, another six months which means the two copyright strikes you receive the second time First one you receive it the first time you get well it's worth six months. If you get it the second time, that's an additional six months, which means you will get won't they won't expire for a year. So if you get it the third time, your account will be terminated. Which means account is terminated, you lose all your content, your subscribers, view accounts, your AdSense account, which means you lose all the money you have earned on those videos, which you, you had monetized on them, 
everything that you have worked on for me are just now having a bad day which means if you partner with an MCN you'll lose partnership with them until you work again to earn those 10,000 um, views again but I will link to that to that guideline uh, to that article in the description below including the copyright status too and I'll uh, find some videos and link them in the description how to avoid those avoid them so I just don't want be live streaming for three months so I'm just going to be uploading and recording all the gameplays so if you're wondering why not live streaming this is the reason why but I will record gameplays it's just I won't be live streaming them or live streaming anything but I will make a new schedule and release it record, record announcing my live stream and upload it but until I get the uh, the final decision from this strike, I'll let you all know in the video. Thank you all for, for understanding. I hope you all can support me. I will have a Patreon soon. Um, I will find links how to avoid these strikes and all this in the description, including the articles in the description as well. I'll see you guys soon.